Top story, they were following orders. That's one conclusion of a report by the Prison Workers Union looking into the death of inmate Ashley Smith and the charges against those who were meant to be looking after her. CTV's Michael Melling is covering this story and he joins us now. Michael, what can you tell us? Well, Nancy, members of the Canadian Union of Correctional Workers gathered at this Kitchener Hotel behind me to release a report into Ashley Smith de Smith's death. It's called a rush to judgment. Now, the union is pointing the finger directly at management for Smith's death. The 19-year-old choked herself at Kitchener's prison for women almost a year ago. Three, three prison guards have been charged with criminal negligence causing death. The union says uh, workers were told by managers not to intervene when Smith was choking herself unless she stopped breathing. Smith had apparently choked herself several times before. The union says workers raised concerns about what they were told, but management did nothing about it. Now, the union was pressed by reporters today on the claim that they were just following orders versus a duty to uh, help someone who was under their guard, and they had this to say. Our members were conditioned and brainwashed into, into not going into that cell, and as I mentioned earlier, we're not medical experts. Um, you know, we, we we were put in an absolutely impossible situation. Our members, uh, they you know, they, they faced two problems. One is they were ordered not to go in the cell, and secondly, uh, had they have gone into the cell, uh, they probably would have, would have suffered repercussions as well. None of these allegations have been proven in court, but the union is now calling for a public inquiry into the death of Ashley Smith, saying that the management of the prison must be held more accountable.